Now, Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. And this evening, we're going to see temperatures in the low 40s a little while longer. We should start to uh, see more and more sunshine breaking through those clouds as the clouds start to break up. And uh, 9 o'clock, 38 degrees. Uh, we're going to have mostly clear skies, maybe a few scattered clouds still around. And 35 at 11 p.m. Generally clear. Again, maybe a, a few passing high thin clouds at that time. Low clouds should be out of here by later on this evening. And then tomorrow we start off a little bit of sunshine, but then increasing clouds during the day with 47 at noon and 52 at 5 p.m. Our weather headlines calling for the winds to drop tonight. The sky clears out. It'll be cold night, lows in the 20s. Clouds move in on Saturday. We'll see some evening and nighttime showers, but back to dry weather on Sunday. And the clouds will be slow to break on Sunday, but we should get a little sunshine uh, mixing in with those clouds. We did pick up four tenths of an inch of snow today out at Dayton International Airport. And uh, for the month, obviously, first day of the month, that takes us up to four tenths. 14.1 for the season now. We're still a ten and a half inches below normal. Not completely out of the snow season just yet. That won't happen until we get uh, to late April and early May. Uh, looking back at March, average temperature 45.6, 3.5 degrees above average. Rainfall was one inch above average, 2.4 inches below normal on the average snowfall with only an inch and a half. Our warmest temperature just a couple of days ago on the 30th at 80, and the lowest temperature 14 back on the 13th. And Saturday is going to be a chilly start, 28 in the morning with 53 in the afternoon and increasing clouds. Those showers will actually occur Saturday night, so that's good timing. We'll have dry weather for most of the weekend, 55 on Sunday uh, with a mix of clouds, a little sunshine. Lows tonight, mid to upper 20s north as the sky clears out and the winds become light. Upper 20s to near 30 in the southern Miami Valley with highs tomorrow reaching the low 50s north and low to mid 50s over the southern half of our viewing area. And then on Sunday, it uh, looks like temperatures low 50s north, mid 50s to the south. Uh, the Storm Team 2 weather cameras have been showing a lot of cloud cover this afternoon, but at the end of the time lapse here, you'll see those breaks in the clouds getting a little more numerous out there, starting to get some blue skies, some of those rays coming through. Live Doppler 2 HD is dry, and the clouds, as you can see, are starting to thin out a little bit, at least bigger breaks out there across central and eastern Indiana with a more significant clearing to the north. And these clouds will also tend to uh, just start to dissipate as we go through the evening, too, as high pressure builds in. Currently 41 degrees, still breezy, west-northwest wind at 16, making it feel like 33 degrees. Our weather checkers tonight, Jeff Cadora, Bell Center, 38. Over in Jamestown, the low Stetters at 39 degrees. And Jim Robbins in Beaver Creek, 41. Jason Thompson, Brookville at 40. The future track forecast map, you'll see a mostly clear sky tonight. Watch the clouds start to move in during the day tomorrow, clouding up through the afternoon. And then finally, those showers roll into the area tomorrow evening. Our forecast tonight. We clear it out down to 28 degrees. Even though it's breezy now, winds become light and variable later on this evening and overnight. Early day sun tomorrow, followed by increasing clouds, some evening showers, high temperature at 53. And then on Sunday, after the shower Saturday night, back to dry weather 55. Chance of showers Monday, up into the low 60s Tuesday, with a little more likely on the showers, and even a better chance Wednesday with a cold front moving in. 70 ahead of the front, and then back to cooler weather at the end of the week.